Hello and welcome to my 17th video of my name for beginners tutorial series, constants. Constants are similar to the immutable let keyword variables, because both are immutable as in their values cannot change once inside. The main difference between the two is that constants are compile time assigned, whilst let keyword immutable variables are runtime assigned, which means that the constants values must be known before running the program whilst the let keyword immutable variables don't need to be, therefore can be used for input, whilst constants can't. Now you might ask what the actual usage of constants is, since they are so restricted. Well, they are used for performance reasons. If you got a lot of variables that you gave values to yourself when making the program, for example, program settings like resolution, title, etc., all of those can be made into constants and make the program start up faster, etc. Now let me show you how to make the simplest constant in there const p assign 3.14. Constants are made using the const keyword followed by the variable name followed by its initialized value. You cannot declare constants because again, once made, their values cannot change. Let's test that though. Okay, let's make a new constant. const const declaration as integer. Here we go, Visual Studio Code is already detecting a problem. It's telling us expected equal sign, but got end of file. That is because it needs to be initialized, not declared. So this can't work. And if we run this, it says the same. It requires an assignment. So let's comment this out and give it comment error. Now let's try to give a constant a value not known at compile time, like an input, which cannot happen in compile time because you can't give input to a program when it's getting compiled. So let's try that const input assign stdn dot read line. Here we go. Cannot evaluate at compile time. This cannot work. So let's comment this out as well. Error. You can use the keyword const just like any other keyword for making variables as a section to make multiple variables of its keyword kind without having to write the keyword const every time, just like with var and let keywords like this const a assign 1, p assign 2, c assign 3. Now let's also display them with echo, echo a. Let's copy this line two times. Let's change this to b and c and run this. Here we go, they work just like any other kind of variable. Constants can be used to make variables of any type just like var and let variables, for example, an array. Const some array, let's give it five elements, one, two, three, four, and five. Now let's make a for loop to iterate over it for i in some array echo i. Now let's run this. It works. You can also make constant value tuples like this. Let's make a new tuple with a type section. Let's call it person, assign tuple, and then give it a name field of string and age of integer. Now let's make a new one, const, let's call it John, assign now we use the normal parentheses and name as John for the first field of person type and age as 20 for the second one. Now let's echo it, echo John and run this. Here we go. Also works for tuples. Okay, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you liked it. If you had any problems with any part of the video, let me know in the comment section. The code for this video is in the link in the description. Have fun.